Hello and welcome back to Haladrusset Info. In this video, I will show you how to fix your Logitech MX Master 4 shuttering cursor problem. Let's begin. So the shuttering cursor issue is surprisingly very common, especially in the field of Bluetooth mice. So how can we fix it? Well, unfortunately, the most common reason that you have this fear that you have this bug is the fact that you're using a brute of mice in the first place. Now, I know how it sounds, it sounds pretty bad, and especially in case of this, because let's be honest, this is kind of a premium mouse. It's almost $150, it's very, very expensive, and it has many beautiful features, so its connection shouldn't be as bad. However, if you're using a very, very bad Bluetooth um, adapter or Bluetooth just port in the first place, even such a great mouse still can have troubles. So instead, I would advise you to not connect using the Bluetooth, which we can see here. I'm connected to Bluetooth by my hot MacBook Pro. And because this MacBook Pro is quite old nowadays, and if I would increase the and distance between my mouse and the MacBook, then this would result in the shuttering cursor. However, or sorry, it's a stuttering cursor. However, if you will use the boot receiver, which is basically the USB receiver that you have in your package when you're buying this mouse, this has much better connectivity uh, than, and much better signal than the Bluetooth uh, signal because it's just better, it's directly, it's specially engineered for this mouse, which is very, very good. And the other problem that could be resolving in your uh, finger, uh, sorry, in your cursor stuttering is the, uh, the pointer speed. Personally, I doubt it, but you can always check it out by simply heading into the point scroll press, then pointer speed, and here you have a couple of different options. If you're not, if you do not have the extended sensor range enabled, you can always simply enable it. And thanks to that, you should have, well, extended sensor range, meaning that it should detect the range better, hopefully. And hopefully, once again, it will fix your stuttering cursor. Otherwise, well, perform a hard reset, reconnect and connect once again, and just try to praise to the god that your $150 mouse will still work properly, hopefully. <laughs> anyway, that's all for this video. If you found it useful, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching. See you next time.